That's how our President Donald Trump is preparing to deliver his first speech to a joint session of Congress. The address comes in the midst of a tough start for the Trump administration, according to some, and as Republicans seek reassurance that the White House has their backs on some top priorities. CBS 42's Karen Kaifa is in Washington with the latest. Hi, Donald John Trump. Forty days after his swearing in, President Trump heads back to Capitol Hill, an opportunity to convince Congress and the American people he's on the right track, even amid low approval ratings. He needs to move the tone more towards pulling together on uh, common yeah. areas. That's what uh, legislation is about. The president is expected to highlight campaign promises kept so far, pulling out of the Trans-Pacific Partnership Trade Agreement and movement on job creation. But these actions have mostly been taken without the congressional cooperation he'll need for looming big agenda items, like repeal and replacement of the Affordable Care Act, a goal stalled amid GOP intra-party squabbles. Hill Republicans will be listening for an embrace of the House GOP plan. This is a plan that we are all working on together, the House, the Senate, and the White House, so there aren't rival plans here. The president is also expected to pitch a federal budget that boosts defense and security spending by $54 billion. The plan could put him at odds with both parties. Democrats opposed to cuts in domestic programs to offset that spending, and some Republicans who wanted to see cuts or changes to Medicare and Social Security. We don't know where the cuts are coming from, but it's hard to see with this magnitude of cuts that, once again, uh, middle-class people, working families are going to be hurt. White House officials say President Trump will present an optimistic vision to a primetime audience and members of his own party looking for policy points to rally around. On Capitol Hill, Karen Kaifa, CBS 42 News, coverage you can count on. Now, CBS 42 News will carry Mr. Trump's address live tonight. You can watch it right here on CBS 42 beginning at 8 o'clock.